Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Today's video is a long time coming. I am so excited to finally be able to share this with you. I received this item five weeks ago and I tried to do an unboxing. The footage just did not work out and finally I ended up wearing the item today. I was invited to a beautiful, beautiful event by Louis Vuitton and I will share that in another video. But for purposes of this video, here is the item. I already wore it and I like to keep it real on the channel so there's no ribbon, there's nothing on here because I've already unboxed it and wore it. So I just wanna share with you by the title, you already know, this is from the Louis Vuitton Nego collaboration, and this is a pre-fall 2020 item. Nego is a Japanese streetwear designer. Originally, when I saw the photos for the collection, I was drawn to one and only one item. That item is this one right here. And let me just go ahead and share it with you. So if you're new to my channel, I hope that you enjoy the video. And if you do, please go ahead and click on the subscribe button down below, hit the notification bell, and give this video a like. It's really helpful when it comes to YouTube. And for my returning subscribers, I'm glad you're here. Let's get into this bag. Let's open this baby up. And here it is. It is the mini tote from the LV Nego collaboration. It is referred to as the mini tote with the wave. But let me just go ahead and give you a little bit of a 360 and then we'll look at it a little more closely. Here's the side the back and the front. Again, this is the beautiful blown up Damier Eben print with the classic monogram. It says Louis Vuitton right here and all the leather on this bag is treated leather and that is a treat for me. The other thing I want to mention is all of the all of the details on the bag are black. They're like a matte black. Let's see if you can see there. And right here it has beautiful gussets on every single corner with the treated leather and also the beautiful LV flower. And I hope I hope that you could see it. Again, everything is the matte black and the treated leather. It's got the beautiful treated leather on both of the corners. And to give you an idea of size, and I will give you some mod shots also, this bag is 14 inches high 10 inches long and five inches in depth. It is actually a little bit larger than what I thought it was going to be based on the photos. Of course, I didn't pay attention to measurements. Usually I just am drawn to something and the brain forgets about everything else. So I was very pleasantly surprised to see that it's actually bigger than what I thought. A lot can fit in here, my friends. A lot can fit in here. The interior of the bag is one full compartment. Oh, we'll get to the strap. It does have a strap. But the interior is one big open compartment. It is lined with fabric. It is not microfiber. It is kind of just, uh, I'm not sure what kind of fabric it is, but it's not microfiber. And this one is made in Italy. 
and it has two slip pockets on the back and the slip pockets are large enough that you can fit an iPhone 11 S because that's what I currently have. It does come with a strap, which is another really nice feature. It is a adjustable strap again in the treated leather. It has this nice piece of soft black leather tab for your shoulder so it's more comfortable. And again, as you can see, it has the matte black clips. The strap clips on the side of the bag which is very nice. I was very excited to see that I did not have to clip it to the handle. At first I thought you had to clip it to the handle and then I realized it had the, it had these on the side. There we go. And I will show you how it looks on me. But yeah, this is the bag. I. It's just, it's very different. It's not what you would call a classic bag, but I love the, I love the silhouette. It's kind of like a sack plait. Love it. And this is how it looks like just holding by the handle. And this is how it looks on the shoulder and this can be adjusted so that it's a little bit higher or a little bit lower. And this is how I wore it today. I pretty much wore it on my shoulder and grabbed it by the handles when I didn't want to have it on my shoulder. Well, my friends, that's it for today. I hope that you enjoyed this reveal and I will see you soon. Take care of yourselves. Bye.